So I'm uh, based here in Bangalore. I've been here mostly since the end of 2014, and I run Wells Fargo's analytic platform. We support all lines of business, uh, doing everything from data wrangling all the way up to machine learning and NLP. I think the thing about AI is we really don't understand it. I mean, at its core, we understand it can help us do so many things. But therein lies a problem, and, and the problem is we don't really know what's going on in some of these black boxes. And AI is going to be smarter than we are. And we don't understand how AI works, so ultimately we're going to need human reasoning and humanity embedded within AI to make sure that it's not doing evil things. Yeah, so there are a lot of challenges around AI. First of all, um, we have a tremendous need for people that can build machine learning models. But I think that's actually the lesser problem that we have. And I think the bigger problem is we don't have the data structures that we need. And I think we also don't have the computing power that we need. And I think, uh, I think moreover, we need some clarity on what we're doing with AI and uh, what AI is really, and then how we're best using it. Machine learning isn't always the right answer. It can often be the easy answer. It can often be the, the fastest answer. But then it's difficult to really understand what the machine learning program is doing. I think the gap is actually bigger than what we think it is. And what I mean by that is we're not clear on what we need AI to do, and, but there is a mad dash to go out and hire people to do it. I think that the skills gap will naturally uh, resolve itself and we'll have plenty of people to do the work. But I think right now, as we're just entering this frontier, there's a bit of a scarcity mentality. I think Cypher, I think Cypher is just amazing. I mean, I tried to get into some of the rooms and it was standing room only. I couldn't get into there. And my question, my question for Cypher is what's your business continuity plan? Because every analyst in the country is here. And if this building goes down, the entire economy of India goes down. There's just so much for everyone here and I'm really excited to be a part of it.